The Interfaith Dialogue for Peace, IDFP, has planned to create an interfaith team which will be concerned with early warnings of potential violence and respond quickly to avoid conflicts before they happen. Co-chairman of the IDFP, Amir Mohammed, made this known during the closing ceremony of the training for religious leaders across five states in Abuja. Mohammed stated that the training, which focused on mediation, conflict resolution and inter-religious dialogue, was extensively taught to participants to reciprocate in their various states. He also noted that the absence of an interfaith team is part of the reasons why some states are violence-prone. An interfaith team that will be concerned about early warning and early responses so as to mitigate conflict before they violent conflict before they happen. We have also taken time to look into mediation, where we talked about is mediation, how do you mediate, what are the principles of mediation. We have talked about conflict management and conflict resolution. What are those types of conflicts? How do you address different types of conflict, conflicts? And now we're ending with inter-religious dialogue. We also believe strongly that religious leaders cannot be able to achieve their goals and objectives without collaborating and coordinating better with policy makers. We just came out of a high-level dialogue on insecurity and COVID-19 uh, on Monday uh, in Abuja here, where we talked about how religious leaders and policy makers can better collaborate to address the issues of insecurity and, pand and the pandemic.